Hi everyone, this video is going to show through how to build a pull up gym. So let's get started. Uh, the first one, we are going to build the base of the, of the pull up bar first. So now, grab the L shaped back piece. And then we will take a long bar like this. Great. And then we are going to do two short. So why now, we're going to punch through the long pieces, like this, the first and the, and the third, all together, and then push it into the second and the fourth, got it, and then second, we're going to grab the edge shape gray pieces and then attach to the end here like this and then and close it with another seven hoses long bar like this so we got the first one ready and then now we are going to make the second one so the second will be the same get the L shape use the long pieces Back lock and punch foot. Then one is not enough, we need two of them. Like this. And then I try to do the second and the fourth. And then H straight. Same as before. And close it. Like this. Got it. And then now we are going to attach another L shape. So grab one more. So for this one, we're going to do two short back lock into the first and the second. Yeah. And then attach it to another L shape. And then we're going to do it like this. That's good. Do the same for the other one. Your favorite one. But we're doing this way. Same here, another L shape. So we can see two of them it's against each other. Okay. And then why now? Take two more. Head to the first the other side actually I'm sorry this side the first the second like this and attach it to a long piece so it's like the longest one and the first and the second so it's like this and we are going to do the same thing for this one as well Got it. Then we're pretty much done. And then we just list it to two, two more to make sure it's stable. So how can we do that? We're going to, let me do this one first. The short one, and then attach it. There's two holes on the edge shape. Do the same thing. To attach them like this. Got it. Same for the other one. You can see all of the things they are symmetric, but they're against each other. Right. And then use another two on this bar attach to each other to the very end of it and then make it put it together. 
together. But you see why now? It's still movable. We want it to be very sturdy. So we're going to grab the L shape and then push in to both of the end here. And then we got to do one more here. Right? This. And then we're going to do the same thing for the other one. Yeah. And then we got two like this. And then we're going to flip it. It doesn't really matter which way, where is it, but not to go to the other end, give some some of the space, and then just punch it in. Doesn't really matter. And then the other one. Same. Oh. Because we want to do it like this way. So we have to flip on the side here. See, it's very sturdy right now. It's not moving at all. So this is very sturdy right now. It's not moving at all. So we are done with the pull-up bar. Right now we are going to build a buggy. So first, I'm going to leave this one aside. Okay. So first we are going to build his arm. Going upward. And the turning part here. To attach to the motor. So get a cross piece and push into it. Mm -hmm. and then for the L orange gear, <coughs> sorry, you're going to attach two black piece like this. And then attach it. The other one, so you get the gear like this. Okay, I need two of them, so I'm going to make one more. Okay. So right now you're going to attach these pieces. It will be cross on one side, and then hold for the other side. Attach it. So it will be with the cost here going in. So it will be the same for the other one. Okay. And then right now this another cost here, cost hole, and then we're going to attach it the bucket body see and make sure they're all pointing up they're all pointing up for both sides great and then now we are going to build the arm parts here so we are going to grab a long piece of the gray Make sure the color is the gray color, not the black one. Because this one, it decided to be moved around. And, but the black one, it decided to be sturdy and not moving. So that's why we have to use the gray piece here, but the black piece in there. Okay. And then attach this one to the first hole. And then grab a back piece here to the second. Same for the other side. Then right now you're going to attach it into the three holes, orange pieces. 
and the same for the other side. Got it? Great. Now we're going to use those L-shaped pieces right now. So before that, maybe you can try to do build a leg first. And then grab the gate gray piece, cross and holes, and attach it to the bottom. The other one. Got it. And then use this white pieces. Attach it to the hole here. And then same for the other one. Now, we're going to build a leg. We're going to use this L shape to build a leg, right? So I'm going to attach this one to the L shape orange piece, I mean H shape. And then doing both of both of them, like this. And then we're going to use a gray, use a back piece to the both end. And attach it together. Sounds good. So we have the legs ready. Now we are going to finish the arm here. Okay. So we need to attach these pieces, the cross and the hole, the gray one, to the top here. And then same for the other side. Like this. And then we are going to grab the L-shaped white pieces and then attach it across to the to the top here. And then do the other one like this. Got it? And then flip to the other side. We're going to attach another piece. Go to straight. We attach it to a five hoses, orange piece like this. Okay, it will be the same for the other side. Okay. Like this. So at the very end, we have to attach these pieces to here so we can do a pull up motion like this. So grab one more gray piece, attach it to the inner one, second hole here, like this. Then grab the seven holes pieces back one and attach. So this one will be the end here, like this, and then will be the second hole to the last. So it will be like this. Same for the other side right now. So you are done with the buggy part also. So let's come back to the pull up bar we finished before. And then right now we're going to attach them together. And make sure the one 
with the ashtray that's 30 base is behind the buggy so it should be like this so his hands I mean his legs even when it drop down it won't stack to each stack to each other so how we do that we're going to grab these two long pieces then push two yellow gear in okay and then go for it and then attach another one so to make sure it's not moving show the same for the other one It is. And then right now, attach it to the pull up bar. Yeah. It is. And then right now, we're going to grab the last two pieces and attach it to the outside. Tighten it. Then you are done with the pull up buggy. And then you can play with it using the sloth move. And then keep pushing up and fun like this. Thank you so much for watching. And have your creative expansion pack ready and try to challenge yourself to pull to build this pull up buggy see you next time